just got ghosted before my date. I was supposed to go on a date this evening at a really nice restaurant with a man I met on Bumble. He also made reservations there and he planned for us to grab drinks at a brewery beforehand. You know, we matched yesterday and we were talking the night away. He immediately made reservations. He wanted to meet me and we talked all day. We were both looking forward to going on this date and we couldn't wait to get ready and to meet each other. And four o'clock rolls around and guess what? I went to go send a message just to confirm where we were meeting at five and he had deleted his Bumble account. And I called the reservation or the restaurant where the reservation was at and he also canceled that as well. He was such a coward that he had to delete his account and couldn't send me a message just to say, hey, like, I changed my mind or it's not working. He had to literally delete his own account. Like, I got ready. I got completely ready. I was looking forward to this. He led me on. I got so used today. Like, so bamboozled by this man. And for what? For absolutely nothing for him to delete his Bumble account because he's a coward. Uh, is this what online dating is? It's just bullshit men that just like to ghost women or just to lead them on for no reason and have like no intention of meeting us like i get i'm curvy i get i'm not everybody's cup of tea like you can just send me a message like any decent man would be like hey just not feeling it i wouldn't have any issue at all you just had to do all of this and i wasted my time getting ready for what for nothing Men in California really do suck. I wonder if it's this bad anywhere else, but I definitely feel like I need to get off of this dating roller coaster of online dating since apparently men just suck here. <laughs> Rejected. Men are waking up and realizing the American woman mindset is altered, skewed. It's bad for business. It's bad for marriage. It's bad for life. Why is that? Because the modern day woman is very masculine. Society and the feminist have skewed and altered the matrix into having women believe, get a good education and a good job and you don't need a man. And you're seeing the percentages and the numbers and statistics go up. More and more people are single and less and less birth rates are happening in America. And men are tired of it. So what's happening now, men are getting passports and going overseas to find a woman. And American women are upset and sideways about it. Number one response is, they can't handle us. And for once in your life, you're correct, they can't. Nobody else can handle you. And on top of that, nobody else wants to handle you. When a woman says this, nobody can handle me. That's why they're doing it. They're mad, they're bitter. What is the outcome that you want? Because if you're a woman that says you don't need a man, then you have no business commenting on this video and disagreeing with me. Is it just me? Yes. Is it just me or do men not approach women anymore? Like. I'm not the approaching type. I can't approach anyone. But I saw some fine, fine men. Did you see some? I did. Yeah, we just went to uh, Black on a Block in Texas. Saw some gorgeous men. But none of them approached me. And I can't, I'm not the approaching type. I can't do it. But if you approach me, I am nice. I'm just about to be single for forever. Wonder why men no longer approach? Well, do you modern women give men any incentives to approach you? So my question is why? Why is it that the younger generation, um, why why do you guys not do that? Why do you not walk up to women anymore? Um, why do you not try to go further along after you've gotten the number and uh, start an initial conversation? Was the, was it, I, I don't know, I'm, I'm so new to the dating world, this new generation. Is it, you're intimidated? Because I know about intimidation. I actually did a post, um, a couple, a couple posts back about being so shy. Since then, I've done a complete 180 and now I'm just like, you know what, like I'm blocking up to people and I'm going to introduce myself because I'm like, what is there, what is there to lose?